everyone. Welcome to DIY in 5. I'm Trisha Hirschberger and we've all been there. You're about to take a selfie with Jake Gyllenhaal and suddenly your phone dies. It's the worst. Today we'll go over the top five tips to improve the battery life of your iPhone or iPad in iOS 9. First, find the apps that drink battery like wine at a bachelorette party. Apps are awesome, but they can be a huge battery drain. Apple has a simple way to see the worst offenders. Go into Settings, Battery to find the battery usage info. This shows which apps drain battery the most in the last day or the last week. There's also an option to see how much time you use the app, and this can be really helpful when trying to find said worst offenders. An easy fix that works on any device with a backlit screen is to turn down the screen brightness. Having your screen so bright your face starts to tan is not necessary. Lowering the brightness to under 50% can get you a few extra hours of battery life. To lower the brightness, just swipe up from the bottom and slide to the desired setting. Another feature that drains battery life is GPS and location services. While really helpful for getting directions, checking weather, etc., you most likely don't need it enabled on every app that requests access. Go into Settings, Privacy, Location Services, and check to see which apps are using your location that may not need to. Once you find these apps, simply turn off location services. Another battery draining feature is Auto Update. While this is a handy way to keep your apps up to date, if you have a lot of apps, it can be a real drain. Go to Settings, App, and iTunes Store's Automatic Downloads to turn it off. Finally, you can check out iOS's Low Power Mode. This is one of the simplest ways to get some extra battery life out of your device. iOS 9 automatically gives you the option when your phone is at 20% battery, but you can turn on Low Power Mode at any time. Low Power Mode turns off Mail Fetch, Background App Refresh, Automatic Downloads, and some of the visual effects. To turn it on manually, go into Settings, battery and slide it on. By trying these simple fixes, you've now got a device that should last as long as you do. Please like this video and subscribe to this channel for more DIY tips, hacks, and expertise. I'm Trisha Hirschberger, and thank you ever so much for watching DIY in 5.